Good day students. Last week we discussed about how plants make their own food through a process called photosynthesis. Today we are going to talk about special plants called insectivorous plants. What are insectivorous plants? Plants which trap and feed on insects are called insectivorous plants. Some examples are Venus flytrap. As you can see in the picture, there is an insect which is in between the two sides of this Venus flytrap. And this is how it closes its two parts and the insect is trapped. Next example is pitcher plant. Can you see it is in the shape of a pot? The leaf is modified in the form of pitcher and there is another leaf which forms a lid. As the insect gets trapped in this pitcher plant, the leaf automatically closes and traps the insect inside. This is sundew plant. All these protrusions which you see they are sticky. As the insect comes and sits on this flower, the flower closes these sticky ends and the insect gets trapped. Now why do these plants eat insects? Actually, these plants grow in poor soil which lacks nitrogen salts. So, to get extra nourishment, these plants started eating insects. But these plants also make their own food through the process of photosynthesis. The insectivorous plants are found mostly in wet, damp, humid and acidic soil which is deficient in nutrients like marshy areas, bogs, wetlands, coastal plains. They are found in the wet regions of North America, Australia and tropical regions. Now here we have the video link where you can see how these plants trap the insect. You can see them in action. Now they suffocate the insect and then these insects are broken down and digested and consumed by the plant. Now we have the assignment for you. Do this assignment on a separate sheet and name it as insectivorous plants and submit it when the school reopens. I hope you enjoyed this presentation.